Biometric authentication refers to an advanced verification procedure that utilizes your unique biological characteristics such as facial recognition or fingerprint scanning as primary reference to grant access. And the Google Play Store app in modern Android phones also has this feature. In this tutorial video, I will walk you through activating the Google Play Store biometric authentication feature on the latest Google Pixel 7 smartphone. But before we move on, please like and share this video so that it will also reach other viewers who might as well be needing this guide. Now let's get back to our topic. To get started, navigate to the home screen or apps viewer of your phone and then tap on the Play Store icon. Doing so will launch the Google Play Store application. While in the Play Store app's main screen, tap on your account profile logo located on the upper right corner of the search bar. A side menu will load up next. In the side menu, you will see different options and features that you can use to manage downloaded apps and services associated with your Play Store account. Tap Settings from the given options to proceed. The Play Store app settings menu will load up next. Here, you will see a list of drop-down menus and their respective sub-items. To continue, tap Authentication. A drop-down list of options will load up next. To activate the biometric authentication feature for Google Play purchases on the phone, tap to turn on the switch next to biometric authentication. If prompted, enter your Google Play Store account password to save and apply the recent changes you've made to the authentication settings. Biometric authentication will then be activated on your phone. As a result, it will trigger the Play Store app to ask your password or fingerprint to authenticate your next purchases. You can also set your device to require authentication for all purchases through Google Play. Simply tap Require Authentication for Purchases and then choose your preferred purchase authentication setting. And that's it! Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and tap on the bell icon should you wish to get notifications on the next video tutorials and troubleshooting guides we publish. Thank you for watching.